Let's get a level. Another one. Another one. Yo, that was nice as hell. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to another video and a new exciting event quest that just dropped earlier today. We're going to face off against two Scorn Magnus in the arena. And for today's build, I just went with some evade window to be a little bit more on the safe side. And then we have the usual stuff in there. And um, yeah, one of the best tips I can give you guys whenever you feel unsafe, not just against multiple monsters, is the combination of Sacred Chief and Tempered Spirit Blade. Tempered Spirit Blade, really, really underrated in my opinion. I'm going to show you why it is so good right now. Alright, here we go. Uh, so it looks like the other guy will spawn in once we deal enough damage to this guy. The way he made me miss there. But yeah, it was clearly my fault. Um, so what is going on with... This dude, uh, he's supposed to go for that attack right away, but he just whipped out his blades instead, which I guess is uh, something unique to this event first. Which is kind of awesome, they did the same thing with um, Hazard Rajang, where he would spawn in golden state right away. Oh, good thing I had round slash, I, I thought I had reckoning for a second. Let's go for another handbreaker. Yeah, this opening is big enough you can switch and still go for Handbreaker. I hate that attack. Let's get in front of him so he won't do it again. Get that breakage and now we charge. Yeah, uh, you might be wondering what is this? You set up circle and now you go for Sacred Chief. And no. But it works out. <laughs> but yeah, um... Probably not something you want to do. I mean, Circle and Sacred Chief... It, Circle and Sacred Chief, sorry, used to be terrible. Now it's uh, usable, I guess. But yeah, it's still not great. Gonna get that red gauge back, hopefully. And uh, charge. Whip. Get away. Nice. I hope... Uh, oh yeah. He does, shouldn't have too much health left. Whenever he goes for this, I think he's close to dying. I think it's similar to uh, Teostra's brown breaking only when he's like 30% health or something. Let's see what he does. Good. Uh, let's hit a Tempest and go for Handbreaker. After this, I mean. Yeah, nice. Uh, second guy is still uh, nowhere to be seen. Let's go for a bomb tree. Yeah, it's kind of a shame. I was kind of hoping they would make him spawn in earlier. He's probably going to spawn right when this guy is on skull. Oh, actually a little bit earlier. There he is. Alright. But yeah, I should stop complaining about stuff like that. Like, um, I'm just not normal when it comes to stuff like that. And I'm sure for most of you guys it's going to be... A challenge still. I, and again, I don't mean to sound cocky when I when I say stuff like that. Uh, it's the same thing that happened with when it the Ematsu upload. Like for me, I always speak of the per perspective of a speedrunner, right? But um, Ematsu, I mean, he's a great fight for casuals. I can see that. And I feel bad for talking down on it, but like for me and most of my speedrunner friends, we just don't like Amatsu. But I should just make stuff like that more clear that it's just my perspective from speedrunning. You know. Gonna get a gap point there. Um, I'm just gonna go for foresight on this. I'm not too comfortable with the, with the timing on that explosion, to be honest. Oh my god, look at that sink. <laughs> that was almost perfect sink. Yo, what? Bro. Oh, actually we're fine. And we still have our Moxie. That is that's fantastic news. And his temple on that. I think he actually hit me with that um, ball as well at the same time. I'm not too sure why I would charge here. But uh, we can tank it. I actually missed everything on that second chief. Foresight. And um, yeah, I got saved there by the auto counter. Which is another thing. Um, like, yeah. When you're unsure 
just foresight and go into the second chief thing. Like, if you have at least one level, you're not gonna take damage, right? I should counter that on accident. Let's get a level. Another one. Another one. Yo, that was nice as hell. <laughs> Let's drop this. Yes. Get dunked. That was hella nice. I feel like you should get a longer opening on the Hellfire topple if it if you get it from a dunk. Alright, uh, let's finish this guy off with um I think I wanna try a sec chief playstyle on him. I usually never go for that on these guys. Just always circle and um good old handbreaker. And serene pose, of course. See what he does here. Oh, I love dodging these. Another one? No. Nope. Don't. All right. I was so scared he would uh, get toppled from the second hit. Because usually that is what happens for me. That's why I don't like second chief that much. Have a tempered. Another one. Ah, that missed. Oh yeah, I should switch to get some uh, sharpness back. Actually, forget about heaven sent. That is a nice charge. Alright. Uh, damage is not too great with this build. But it's fine. It's good enough. Uh, we have a red gauge. We're gonna charge... Once he is done here. Oh, I messed up. Try to go for side. Gonna have to roll. Alright, just one. I thought he would always do two... Um, in this stage of the fight, to be honest. But that is the great thing about this game. You you um, never stop learning. Yeah, definitely want to use Foresight on that one. Not too comfortable on the, on the timing on that. Let me just charge. Ooh, nice. Again. Awesome. Don't get toppled too early. All right. Perfect. What you got? Nice. Awesome. Charge. Get away. Oh my god, that was so close. <laughs> Got that. Are we good? We're good. Why is that damage so low? Only 1k on the big hit on his blade? It should have been higher. Uh, we got Skull. Maybe we can finish him off on Yellow Handbreaker. Let me try. On the tail, actually. Uh, not quite. Don't get hit by that attack. I hate that one. He actually has more health left than I thought. Come on. Don't be so hard to kill. There we go. Alright guys, um, I actually, if you're interested and you haven't seen it, I actually did Triple Skull Magna from start to finish in one arena. Um, it's a custom quest. I'm gonna link it down below if you want to watch that. And thank you so much for watching this video. I appreciate it. And as always, happy hunting. Bye-bye.